I'm gonna show you how to do iPhone split screen without jailbreak. You could use this for example to multitask and watch a YouTube video or listen to music on YouTube at the same time as scrolling your Instagram or Twitter feed. Maybe you wanna compare two Amazon products at the same time or do split screen multitasking by Googling while referring to your favorite news app. You could even log in to two Instagram accounts at the same time. This split screen method is free and easy works on any iPhone and takes less than a minute to set up. It also looks and feels very smooth to use. You can already do multitasking or split screen on the iPad like this. With the iPad, you can use any two apps at the same time and move them around like so. There is a way to enable this by first jailbreaking the iPhone, but I certainly don't wanna do that and nor do you. So the next best legit thing to do is to run your apps in split screen and multitask via a web browser. But iPhone doesn't have a built-in function to allow you to do this either. So we'll grab this completely free app from the app store called Split Screen Dual Window. It looks like this, so make sure you get the right one as there are other apps out there that you need to pay for. I'll put the link in the description below for it so you can get the right one. So I'll click to install that on my iPhone 12 Pro Max. So to do split screen without jailbreak and start multitasking, go ahead and open the split screen dual window app. The first thing you're presented with is this prompt to tell you that you can move the split screen proportions around. Some other apps don't have this feature, so it's pretty handy. I'll just demo that for a second. As you can see, there are two web browser windows. And if you want to swipe the split all the way up to the top, you can see the whole of your bottom page. And likewise, if you swipe down, you can see the whole of the top page. In a moment, I'll show you how to use some of the apps inside the split screen. But first, if you're getting something out of this content, then please hit the like button below. Subscribe to my channel and hit the notification bell for more useful videos just like this. Thank you. Back to iPhone split screen. There are some sample apps shown here as hotkeys, but you can go to the web-based version of any app or website you want. Let's tap the YouTube in the top window here. It will ask you to sign in here, but once done so, you'll stay signed in. We'll do the same down the bottom and log into Instagram. You can see here in the iPhone split screen, we are playing a YouTube video at the same time as being able to scroll Instagram. Now, if I move the split screen up, the YouTube video disappears although it's still playing the sound. And I can see the Instagram in full screen. Likewise, I can drag the split down to the bottom so that I can see more of what's happening on YouTube at this time. There's endless ways how to play around with the split screen feature. However, do note that this web-based experience isn't the same as app-based experience, but it's a great compromise overall for the iPhone multitasking functionality you get. At the bottom, you'll find a share button and you can share either the top page or the bottom page to your friends. There's also a bookmarks and recent pages button. Also, you'll see that there are the occasional ads shown, but you can usually skip them after a few seconds or so. If you really enjoy this iPhone split screen multitasking app and you are sick of the ads, they charge just a few dollars to unlock the ad free experience. I'd recommend you put this in your dock or on your first page or even on your home screen so you can access it easy. This split screen looks great on large displays such as iPhone 11 or 12, Pro or Pro Max, and the iPhone X. It still works well on an iPhone 7 or 8 though also. Watch this video now to learn about the new portrait mode video on the iPhone 13. It allows you to get that blurry background similar to the effect you get with the portrait photo mode. It's really cool, so check it out. It will ask you to sign in, but once done, you'll subscribe to my channel and hit the notification 